in this video we will see that how we can use excel formulas in microsoft word for example sum formula average product count minimum and maximum formulas so let's get started we have two tables in microsoft word the first table has two columns the first one has names of the persons and the second one has the salaries of the month when we will select any cell of this table for example i select this then you can see that two new tabs have been introduced by the microsoft word the first one is table design and the second one is layout if you want to learn that how we can insert and format tables in ms word like this then click on the i icon now for example we want to calculate the total of all these salaries so we will click here on this cell and then we will go here in layout and we will click on formula option here you can see a dialog box and in formula section you can see a sum formula here you can see the structure of this formula for example equal sum and above above mean it will calculate the sum of all above values so let's click ok so here you can see the sum of all these above values now let's remove this and let's explore more options we will again go here in formula and again we will use this sum formula and now we will choose a number format here you can see different number formats for example either you want to choose the value in percentage or with decimal i want to choose the value with decimal so i will select this and click ok now you can see the value in decimals if you want to insert the dollar sign with this value then you just have to click here at the beginning of this number and you have to go here in insert tab here you will find a symbol option here you can see the symbol of dollar just click here and the symbol will be inserted you can also use other formulas like average formula maximum and minimum formula so let's clear this first now for example we want to calculate the average of all the above salaries so again we will go here in layout tab go here in formula and here first we will remove this formula here you can see the option paste function we will click here and here you can find different formulas we want to calculate the average so we will click here on average make sure that you have placed the equal sign before the formula now we want to calculate the average of all above values so we will type here above we will choose the number format and just click ok so here you can see this is the average of all the salaries of the month in second table you can see here these are the names of the persons or the employees this is the bonus that have been given to them and this is the salary we want to calculate the total salary with bonus given to them so i will click here go in the layout tab click on formula now here i want to know the sum of bonus and salary so here you can see it has given me the option of left it means that now it will calculate the left values for example 100 and 200 now just click ok and here you can see the total in formula tab here you can see you can use all the formulas like average count define false max minimum mode note there are different formulas you can use all these formulas in ms word if this video has added value to your skills please subscribe our youtube channel that's all for this video